And what's going on you bastards welcome back to another grand summoners video where we got a lot of news to cover here today we're first gonna talk about the global side which uh yeah uh luana's coming anyways moving on no, uh, it's just like it's this is the banner it's i don't know it's okay it's not great volty and heart are a pretty good pickup but honestly i think luana kind of falls short from being anything spectacular so i i wouldn't if you're missing heart i i don't I, with kill a kill coming and then this next crossover we're gonna be talking about that's coming back to jp uh you might not want to even summon for him okay so there was a live stream that was announced on the jp side of grand summoners and it's guess the collab rerun right so this was put out at like yesterday at 5 a.m eastern and you know there's like uh three random users with the correct guess will win 200 crystals right on twitter but then a little bit later you know 5 36 a.m here's the live live stream link like it's like about 24 hours later this is like i don't know how many people that they expect to answer but anyways uh it is fate fate prisma Ilya is coming back and i think uh licked the nameless girl i i i'm not too familiar with uh prisma Ilya. actually i started watching it and i i just couldn't finish it because it was uh, let's just say it's not my cup of tea uh, i do love the fate series but this one specifically no not really so we have a new roster of characters coming into the game right so the highlights new collab summon event with original story event limited exchange shop uh, uh luck gems for your characters and god god damn it they're releasing so many new characters and then with the original batch dude i i don't know how long this farming is going to take i feel like this farming it, you're just going to be there for days just farming there weeks the original fake collab story rerun too also with uh limited crest yeah we had those before uh so yeah it's kind of like a uh, beach uh summer summary type uh, uh series i guess i don't know uh but yeah they're all in these uh little summer outfits uh we're looking at the arts this is sp arts as well i don't know if youtube <laughs> like i i don't i don't know is this okay oh is this okay to like show i don't i don't know I, it's uh, not not the biggest fan of it so we got a whole bunch of characters. I didn't know. I thought this was like Shiro's neighbor or some stuff like that. That was like, dude, Fate is one of the most confusing goddamn anime you ever watch. If you yeah, like, you have to have a PhD to fully understand what the hell is going on in the in the Fate universe, you know. But Bazette, she's like a new new character, and then we have Rin and Luvia. But I think, god damn, uh, I think we have uh, a, oh damn um. There's a little bit of a different than this time around. I think this time it's more so Luvia and Rin, not so Rin and Luvia, because uh, in this iteration, uh, yeah, they're just showing the arts right here. It looks like uh, it's Luvia at the front, and then Rin kind of just comes in for an assist. Let's see. Oh, is this some goofy... That is some of the dude. When they bring like the the wrecking ball in, it's just like oh, what? That is some that is some top tier goofy shit. I'm gonna mute this because I don't know what the music. Yeah, it just comes in. Yeah, I honestly don't know if that music's uh, copyrighted or anything. But uh, then we have a uh, Sakura Mato, which is like in one of the Fate series. It's like uh, Shiro's sister or something like that. I don't know. Her animations, we're going to look at her animations too. Her animations are actually nuts. Yeah, so I won't play the music again. We're just, uh, yeah, we're just going to do this. It's like, dude, they they went a little crazy with her animations. Like, look at this shit. Like, that shit's pretty good for, you know, kind of what we've seen so far. Like, yeah, that's that's pretty nuts that's that's really good looking to me i'm not gonna show all the other animations but i kind of glossed over them and yeah, a lot of them were you know pretty pretty good pretty all right so it looks like it's chloe and bezette first and then you got mio mew and Rinaluvia. then you got Ilya and sakura 
And then uh, you also have all six Fate Summer collab units. Uh, you know, this is on the JP side, guys. This is not global. Global will get this whenever. You know, it's typically a couple months afterwards, but we don't know for certain. But yeah, starting at the end of June and then ending at the middle of August. And then we have the original Fate units getting buffs here. They'll be on one banner and they are getting buffs. So they go over, because I'm not trying to make this uh, a giga long video. You know, for uh, Super Arts on uh, Ilya, they don't, it looks like they're not buffing every aspect of characters. Uh, it looks, I honestly haven't looked at these myself. So it looks like extra damage on the Super Arts. Literally didn't touch anything else here. And then, uh, yeah, HP 80% instead of 90%. So it's little minor changes, which honestly, I don't think a lot of these characters really needed buffs already, but it's kind of nice they're giving them a little bit. Under 90,000% for Miu, and then uh, arts for 10 Wait, is this honestly what Miu does? Increase own arts by 10 per second for 150 seconds? Is that real? I don't have Miu, so wow, yeah, that's pretty crazy. All right, and for Chloe, they got her with an extra 5,000% on her true arts. Not a whole lot. Oh, and then five more seconds uh, for increasing the allies' arts, Jen. I mean, that's, uh, that's that's pretty good. I mean, again, these characters aren't aged out by any means, so they're still very usable. And then for Rin and Luvia, got an extra 10,000%, and then we got an extra 10% on the magic damage buff to it allies and for shiro i was uh pretty interested about him uh it's because this man's already giga strong but it looks like they went a little easy and just gave him a little extra damage on his unlimited blade works so i mean he he didn't uh he, he didn't need a whole lot let's be real here and then we have saber altar Gave her an extra 15,000% on damage. I do like Saber Alter. She can she can whip out a lot of damage pretty quickly. And then, oh, so they just straight up removed on her passive when affected by status ailments. Reduced on accuracy by 30%. Yeah, I, I, I mean, that's probably a pretty good call. Because that, that would feel pretty bad if you're going against one of them bosses that constantly you know, mess with your status, and then you're just like, well, I can't hit anything. And then we get a free unit. That's pretty neato. Okay, I might sound different because I did mess with some of my audio settings because I didn't like, ever since I moved into this new room, I got a little bit of a, like, crappy echo. So I was just trying to deal with that a little bit. All right, and it looks like we're getting two true weapon tickets. And then one collab true weapon ticket. Okay. But the original fate and then the summer fate. Okay. And then we got a bunch of new... Holy crap. New uh, new equips going on here. Jesus, brother. What? There, there's just like so much... <laughs> there's so much to these collabs. That's why like fate is pretty popular. Because it has, what, like six units? And there's just... You know, R.I.P. Uh, you know, summer, summer Shiro. And you got some stickers, bug fixes, game balance adjustments, UI improvements, Grand Battle, which is a new mode that's coming out on the JP side. I haven't really been looking too into it, but a new mode in GS is definitely pretty hype. All right, and it looks like we've reached the end of that. So. Uh, JP is going to be eating pretty good. I mean, we still got Overlord going on, but we're we're in the part of Overlord where it's just like, you know, the collabs when they're when the collabs are over like a month and stuff like that, you're just like, uh, oh my god. Uh you know, you're just like, uh, uh okay, you know, we're kind of done here. So yeah, that's the fake collab. Actually, I I'm, I'm not going to show this. I don't I don't like this. And that's about it, you bastards. Hope you guys enjoyed. Uh, are you guys excited for the new Fate collab? Who are you looking forward to the most from this? Uh, the kits aren't actually out for the new characters. They'll be coming uh, a little bit later on. Uh, yeah, so hope you guys enjoyed, and I'll see you in the next one. Take care. But first, hi there. If you liked what you saw... <sighs> Thank you.